Hello my brothers and sisters and welcome back to another reaction Ow! packed episode of Crystal Butcher and Friends. That was a bit eager, weren't it? I have an amp print there now after. I'll just tell everyone lose lose abuse in me. Oh, shh, no, it wasn't that. That's a joke by the way. Right. I've got five chicken legs here. I'm not gonna use all five. Well I'm gonna cook all five, but I'm not gonna use all five for this particular thing because Let's be honest, it's probably only me gonna eat it. I'm gonna do an extra one just in case Connor likes it. You never know. But we have been in Tesco's, the religion. £1.50. Frank's Red Hot Buffalo New York style cooking a bag. Never seen these before. And I saw it and I thought, do you know what? I love Frank's Red Hot sauce. I love buffalo wings, which I still haven't done on the channel yet. I've still got two jars of red, red hot sauce in there, Frank's Red Hot for it. But I got around to doing it, like everything, like making the sausages. Eventually, at some point, I will do it. Uh, but yes, it's a uh, seasoning with garlic and cayenne pepper from America's number one hot sauce brand, Frank's. Yes. Uh, pack contains one cooking bag, one sachet of Frank's Red Hot Buffalo New York style seasoning. You will need four times 150 grams of chicken breast or 600 grams of chicken. Ugh, thigh fillets do not exceed 600 gram total weight. I'm going to use three chicken legs. Uh, it says here, try tip, try finishing the crumble blue cheese and slice spring onions. So, uh, yeah. I forgot the intro. Never mind, let's crack on it. Well, we, 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 can, we can forget that. Is it kind of a super cool review? Should we give it one of these? Ladies and gentlemen, I give to you... Chris the Butchess, super cool review. <laughs> Better late than never. I don't know if it's a super cool review or, or it's one of these. Well, we got that out of the way, didn't we? Right, uh, preheat oven to 180 degrees. We'll do that right now. Well, while we're here, we'll do that right now. 180 degrees. I'll have to switch it on at the wall. There we go. The oven is on. Right, 180 degrees. Unfold the cooking bag, keeping the tie to use later. Place the chicken in the bag and sprinkle over the seasoning. Hold the bag close. Hold the bag closest, closed at the top, and sh yes, then stand at it. Put it in a bag, shake it up. Uh, uh, twist the bag approximately two inches from the top and secure tightly with the tie provided. Place bag flat on a baking tray, spreading chicken out evenly. Pop into the oven on lower oven rack to allow the bag to expand. Cook for 30 minutes. On so cooked through. Right, remove from bag. Rest for a minute, remove tie, remove from oven, remove from back. Right, you know what? Let's just, instead of pissing around, talking about it, let's get down there. But I can't do that again. And uh, crack on. As you can hear there, the actual, uh, I've got the fill fryer on. I'm cooking the other two chicken legs just in there because I want to keep them completely separate from this Frank's Red Hot Sauce thing. Apparently, a pull here to open. Bag shape, bag. Bag, shake, bake, enjoy. Oh, oh, oh. All that for a sachet. Oh, oh, there's the bag. I forgot about the bag then. Cooking a bag and I forgot about the bag. I was wondering was it was. <laughs> oh dear. Right, so there's our red hot Buffalo New York style seasoning. See what well, let's, let's, uh, it says scissors there, but I'm just gonna get the seasoning to the bottom. Who needs scissors? Just get that. Smells quite spicy. I'll tell you, it smells good. It smells good. Right, our bag. I do not have any idea what I'm doing. Look at the bag. 
Come on, you bastard. Right, I'll be back with you when I've opened this fucking bag. On record and say, opening that bag was an absolute arsehole. <laughs> right, anyway. It was just unraveling it. How the hell did they get that bag that small? I don't know. Right, one chicken leg. Two chicken legs. Three chicken legs. Get the season in. And as usual, it says, and shake it. This is going to be epic, this you know. This is going to be epic. Right, that's done enough in it, right? Let's get them. Put it nice and. I want them all the right way around as well. Right. Right, that's our chicken egg. I hate these things. When you got big clumpy fingers like these things, when you got big clumpy fingers like me, stuff like this becomes a nightmare. It's like threading a needle. No chance. Absolutely no chance of me threading a needle. Come on. Has that done it? Has that done it? By, by your, I think I've got it. Right. In a roasting tin, in the oven, under 80 degrees, preheated, and I'll see you in 30 minutes. Now it said 45 minutes on the packet. Uh, 30 minutes. I've done it for 45. And that, you can't see it. I wanted to get it quick because I've got it out of the oven because the stand is in the way of the oven door. And I wanted it before it started seeping down like that. But yeah, I cooked it for 45 minutes because it was chicken legs on the bone. So I'll give it an extra 15 minutes just to make sure. Now I've got to get in it. That's the, that's the danger with cooking the bag stuff. It's lethal. It's like uncorking a volcano. <laughs> them smell absolutely fabulous there you go so we can get a close up Ooh. there they are my brethren the Frank's hot sauce New York style cook in the bag chicken legs and them smell orgasmic Right, I'm going to fish them out of there, put them on a plate, let them cool down for five to ten minutes just so I can actually eat them, and uh, we'll be sliding it down my gizzard. Right, it's been about ten minutes. Uh, just cooking, keeping a pizza, so I wanted to get that out of the way as well. And these should be cool enough now. Uh, I was going to get up here and eat it like a Neanderthal, but I thought to myself, you know what, let's just get into it. Eat it civilised. Frank's Red Hot Buffalo New York style cook in a bag. Chicken, as you can see there. So it says 30 minutes on the packet. I did it for. You can't focus. There you go. Did it for 45 just to make sure. You can't be too sure of a chicken, can you? Uh, anyway, go with Demi Gizzard. Bad apple tea. Oh, that's got a chick. That is absolutely superb. Oh my God, that is Moorish. I am going to pick that up and eat it like a Neanderthal. But off camera, when I eat, sit down and eat it with my tea, when I, when I put it with something which probably will be chips or something. But that skin is divine. Hey, hey, hey. Three chicken legs, all to me, because there's no way anyone else will eat these. In fact, I don't think I'll need any chips with it, will I? Just eat this. Absolutely fabulous. Mm, mm. Did another flavour as well, I can't remember what it was. I did some Frenchy stuff as well. It's like a new section in Tesco's. You get in there, check it out, have a have a peruse, see what you like, because you know what? That that is absolutely Fabulous. I've had to slightly change the angle of this because I don't know if you can hear this. Listen. That dripping. K 
Kieran's uh, decided to wash his hands in the ba- in the bathroom sink upstairs and just fuck off and leave the tap running. So the, t- the sink's over flooded, gone on the floor, and now it's coming through me, uh, fire, uh, me fire alarm, uh, me smoke alarm through the roof of the kitchen into a bowl that's on a towel on the kitchen floor right under my tripod right now. But uh, do you know what? Less of that. Uh, I was going to wait, but I could be here hours, and I need to get this finished. Then, Buffalo, Frank's Buffalo-style New York thingamajiggies. Let's see, let's do it proper. Frank's Red Hot, Buffalo, New York-style, cooking the bag, seasoning with garlic and cayenne pepper. It's got one of those fucking days, I'll tell you. Uh, It's got three peppers out of four. Not that hot, I've got to be honest. Got a good kick to it, but the taste is immaculate. Absolutely immaculate. So if you're anywhere within Tesco, I don't know if they're in any other supermarket. They probably are. I'm not that way of that persuasion where I like going in supermarkets because I don't don't like going in crowds of people and stuff like that. Uh, I have panic attacks and shit like that, so I just want to get out when I get ratty. Uh, but yeah, it was £1.50 and I highly recommend it you can put it on uh, well it recommends putting on chicken fillets or boneless chicken thighs i stuck it on some chicken legs because i'm a fucking rebel <laughs> and i like chicken legs because you know me it's like caveman days it get outside club of brontosaurus have it for your tea in it but do you know what that was fabulous and i liked it if you like this press like comment share on all your social media and subscribe I've become a family member of hashtag Team CTB, where I fucking love you. Fucking kids are a bit deaf of me, you know.